the spirit of reconciliation, ICAS Assessments acknowledges the traditional custodians of country throughout Australia and their connections to land, sea and community. We pay our respect to their elders past and present and extend that respect to all Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander peoples today. Congratulations to every student who participated in ICAS 2021 and the wonderful families and teachers that supported them. At ICAS Assessments, our aspiration is to help unlock the potential in every learner and to recognise and reward their academic excellence. As we celebrate our 40th year delivering the ICAS competition, we could not be prouder of you and what you've achieved during another challenging year. I really enjoyed participating in ICAS 2021. The thing I love most about ICAS is getting to try challenging questions that I wouldn't normally get to try in school. I think it was great that ICAS in 2021 was able to run so perfectly, even with all the disruptions during the year, and that it was great to be able to challenge and extend myself and to be able to sort of compare where I sit amongst students, not just in my school, but from around the country and even the world. I love how ICAS is a test for everyone. With how popular it is and how many grades it covers, you can essentially take it as a standardised test without worrying about the drawbacks, and that's what I love about ICAS. What I like most about ICAS is probably the challenge that it brings. my inner abilities and inner strengths. ICAS gives me the chance each year to see how much potential I've got and whether I could have done better. It equips you with skills that you can use for higher exams. I get to go deeper in learning. You get to learn new things. We get to know how good we can perform under test conditions. It gives me that confidence to do the future exams. And also, some of the questions were really interesting in the way it was represented. And it was very fun when you like get to the end and achieve. And I also love challenges, so it was fun. I thought it was great and the questions varied on great subjects. I sat the English, Maths and Science ICAS exams and I thought the exams were really challenging and interesting, especially when they are applicable to the real world. ICAS prepares me for the future because I'm really passionate in Maths and Science and these exams will really help me in the future. The most rewarding part of doing ICAS was struggling on a question and then finding out a few months later that I actually got the question right. ICAS lets you know what you're good at and what you may possibly want to pursue in the future. The thing I love about ICAS is the competitive aspect. I get to test myself against other schools. ICAS uh, prepares you through problem solving and through questions that relate to real life situations. The most rewarding part of doing ICAS is the ability to check which questions you got wrong and know where you can improve. Getting results and seeing where I've done well and where I haven't done so well and improving on those parts I haven't done well in. And talking about what we got for what questions with my friends. was the opportunity to extend myself beyond what I'll get in the classroom and also being able to share this unique experience with my friends. I love that ICAS tests have such a wide variety of questions and always keep me on my toes. I love ICAS because it challenges me and encourages me to step out of my comfort zone. What I love about ICAS are the challenging questions that encourage me to think critically. The questions start easy and then get hard and you can do it for all different subjects. I am super happy and proud of myself for winning an ICAS medal. I feel proud of myself because I've been challenged and I've won the ICAS medals two years in a row. I am very happy and proud of myself and now my family will be very proud of me.
and happy for me. Seeing these results really helped me identify my own strengths and weaknesses and allowed me to create realistic and personal goals that assist me in my learning. I'd love to do more eye care and improve myself further this year. I'm definitely going to do ICAST again this year because I think it's a great opportunity. I will definitely do the next ICAST because it is fun and very interesting. It helps me revise things and it's fun. And I think this is a great opportunity for me to learn. I think I would do ICAST again because it provides a different perspective on my academic abilities compared to normal school assessments. Yes, I will do ICAST again as I think it is very rewarding. My favourite thing about ICAST is getting the achievement in the end and knowing you did something well. It surprises me in the end of what I can achieve through ICAS. I was a little bit reluctant at first to do it, but my parents encouraged me. Just turn up and have fun. It's okay if you don't get a medal, but as long as you had fun, you win. The general feedback about the ICAS was it was rather challenging. Uh, so I asked quite a few of our learners afterwards, how'd you find the, the, the assessment task? And they came out and said, Mr. Catalano, it was quite challenging. I did my best, but you know what? Mistakes are part of learning, so I'm glad I did it, so I can learn even more. We really value the ICAS assessment task because they really do allow the children to really think about themselves in the future. So as they get older, assessments and exams will become more and more apparent. So we teach the children about the importance of composing yourself, preparing, reading the questions carefully. Not once, not twice, we ask them to read at least three times before they answer in order to set themselves up for success. It gives them skills that they need for the future, such as critical thinking skills, higher order thinking skills, and problem solving skills. The feedback that I get from students around ICAS is varied. In some cases, for other students, it's the actual challenge of the papers themselves, or for some other students, it's really just the opportunity to challenge themselves on the day, to answer the questions, and to come in and to just have a go. ICAS prepares our students for the future because it gives them an opportunity to challenge themselves beyond what they just cover in class, to tackle questions that have competitive level of rigour at an international standard. Actually, the first time Sahana, my daughter, did ICAS. I find ICAS um, more challenging, say for example, nap plan or some of the tests that she's done. It was assessing her uh, part of her learning and will help her for her future uh, career and exams. I think it just sort of gives her a tasting of what's to come, um, what, what a test means, what to sit down for an hour to do some questions. Um, and also just to understand what time pressure is. I think it's good, it just sort of pushes her out there and challenges her. In what's been an absolutely extraordinary 2021, we could not be more delighted with how many students and how many schools participated in ICAS in our 40th anniversary year. ICAS is entirely unique globally and where some seek to achieve on the sporting field and others seek to achieve in performing arts. Those that are passionate about academics want to succeed in ICAS, and so many of you did this year. And one of the things that excites me so much is that our ICAS participants often go on to achieve such great things in their lives beyond school. Hi, uh, my name is Madeline. I've won 13 ICAS medals in total. So I currently live in Brisbane and I'm one year into my PhD in mathematical physics at the University of Queensland. 10 years from now, I'm hoping to continue in academia. So hopefully I'll be in a postdoctoral research position or maybe even starting to lecture. 
I think doing so many ICAS competitions at a young age helped me get over any sort of exam anxiety I might have had. So I'm now really comfortable in an exam situation, which has obviously helped me through all of my studies. I have a lot of tips for current ICAS students. So speed is kind of the biggest factor in ICAS for me. So anything you can do to save time is a bonus. Uh, sometimes there's questions which you can really quickly estimate an answer without having to do a full calculation and other times using the diagrams to help you will work. Sometimes they're to scale even if they say they aren't. And I also practiced a lot of past exams. These are really useful both for the practicing just in general but also because of repeated questions that can appear sometimes. I'm Monica Robbie. I'm a theatre kid from the south of Tasmania. I've won 11 ICAS medals since I was in year three in spelling, English, maths and science. I'm now working at the Hobart Magistrates Court as a business trainee. The best thing about ICAS for me was the opportunity to test my knowledge and just work out what I was good at. I suppose I'm inspired by wanting to know what I can do. And if I can't do it, I want to know how to do it. Well, my passion is costuming, so I want to study costuming at NIDA. All the different elements of design come into it because something has to look right and feel right within the context of a show and be practical for an actor to wear. Having done an ICAS test, and especially if you've done well, it can be really handy. It looks so good on your resume and it can count as references and things. Hi, my name is Jerry and I'm currently studying overseas here at MIT in Boston in the United States. I have won 14 medals in the ICAS competitions in digital technologies, science and mathematics throughout my elementary and middle school years. I've always had a really strong passion and interest in mathematics and in the sciences, but what really ICAS was able to do for me was to really put that in an environment where I was able to challenge myself to do even better. I think in the end, ICAS is really an opportunity to explore that passion, discover what you like, and really pursue it to the fullest so that in the coming years, you will have the skills and the abilities to make the change to the world that you want to see. The ICAS competition goes beyond the classroom curriculum giving students the opportunity to demonstrate the higher order skills that are essential for success in the modern world, critical thinking and problem solving. To our medal winners, your courage, resilience and love of learning is an inspiration to us and we can't wait to hear of your future successes. We look forward to seeing you again next year. For more information, visit our website, icasassessments.com.